Hello, and welcome to the Southern Sports Network. I'm JJ Necro. And I'm Kara Donnelly, here to update you on the latest in moccasin sports news. Senior night for the women's lacrosse team proved to be a victory as the number four mocks improved to a 16-2 record. The ladies won 15-5 over Lenior Rhine for their 13th straight win. Taylor Gillis, Kendall Kurge, Jackson Marshall, Parisa Sakinajad, Katie Jurgis, and Austin Brown were the six seniors honored prior to the game. Their next regular season game will be against number seven Limestone on April 22nd. They will also be hosting the 2017 Sunshine State Conference Tournament on April 28th and the 29th. The men's lacrosse team overcame a one goal deficit to defeat the Tars on Saturday. With this win, the Mocs are still able to compete for a spot in the Sunshine State Conference Tournament. Their next regular season game will be at home against Lynn on April 22nd. The game will be senior night for the men. Florida Southern's men's tennis team finished out their regular season with a 10-10 record after their 6-3 loss to Rollins over the weekend. The Mocs will be seeded 5th in the Sunshine State Conference Tournament, which is April 20th to 22nd. The three wins for the Mocs were Fabian Lundberg, Brian Savonic in doubles, Lauren Malik Malou in the, in the number four singles, and Lundberg in the number one single spot. A week ago, the women's tennis team fell 5-4 to, to St. Leo in their final regular season match of the year. The Mocs fell to 13-6 overall. They will be taking on St. Leo once more at the SSC Conference Tournament tomorrow. Florida Southern is seeded third. Over the weekend, the Florida Southern baseball team was busy in Greenwood, South Carolina, sweeping three games against Lander. The three games bumped up the 15th ranked Moccasins to a 29-8 season record. Jake Wall struck out 10 batters in just six innings and in the third game. Also, the third game, Jason Sierra, Cody Burgess, and Pablo Cabrera all hit home runs to help the Mocs with their third win over Lander. The second match with Lander was also filled with homers. Mitch Reeves, Sierra, and Austin Maurer had home runs. This three-game matchup with Lander was the first meeting between the two teams. The Florida Southern men's track team competed in the Bucknell University Bison Outdoor Classic on Friday. Bringing in the sixth fastest time in program history was Evan Quinones. He ran in the 1500 meter race. Bobby Ormsby was entered in the 10,000 meter but fell at the start and was able to finish due to the injury. Thank you for joining us on this edition of Southern Sports Network. Hope you enjoyed your semester. I'm Kara Donnelly. And I'm JJ Necro and we'll see you in the fall.